single GPU or dual GPU? Does it still matter in Final Cut Pro X in a Hackintosh? All right guys, so one of the major questions I always get asked about my Hackintosh i9 with the Dual Vegas 64 is, is it truly worth running dual video cards? That's a different story now that 10.4.7 FCPX has been released that relies heavily on metal and also Catalina. So I thought I'd do a quick video to let everyone know, you know, the differences. I've, I've kept track of this stuff through different releases and I would always unplug one of the Vegas, run the test, and do it with the duals. I always clear out my rendered files, my cache, all that stuff is always deleted before each test. So these are pretty accurate. I'm going to give you some results in 10.14.2 and also 10.15 and also 10.15.1. Uh, each release always, you know, is sometimes a difference in uh, speed. So uh, one of the major tests that everyone does is Bruce X, of course. That's the standard for Final Cut Pro. So uh, looking at my spreadsheet here with the numbers on it and everything, Bruce X with a single Vega in the i9 under 10.14.2 done in 8.16 seconds. Now then, the dual Vega has done it in 6.93 seconds. Again, that's under 10.14.2. So, uh, with the recent upgrade, you know, with FCPX, I don't have the numbers for the rest of the uh, .14s. So, uh, I'm going to jump straight into 10.15 with the new 10.47 FCPX. Uh, a single Vegas 64 actually ran in 7.54 seconds. A dual Vega done it in 6.04 seconds. So, we gained a little bit. Now then, under 10.15.1, it ran in 6.49 seconds. The duels done in 5.98 seconds, which is the fastest I have ever got with a Bruce X test. But uh, I always base it on real world videos and stuff. So I always test about seven different videos with each release. It makes it easy. One of the ones I do that's really long is called Christmas Eve. It's on my daughter's YouTube page, but the actual video is about 29, 30 minutes. So uh, I'm looking at the numbers for it. And when I was running a single Vega, it took 23 minutes and 53 seconds. A dual Vega took 17 minutes, 12 seconds. And again, this is under 10.14.2 with Final Cut Pro 10.4.5, I believe. All right, well, let's jump up to 10.15 and the new release of FCPX, which is a 10.4.7. A single Vega done it in 12 minutes and 57 seconds. So right there, we gained over 10 minutes between 10.14 versus 10.15. A dual Vega done it actually in 12.53, which is a little bit faster four seconds but again is it worth four hundred dollars no not for that so with the recent release of 10.15.1 we actually saw the time with a single vega increased to 13 minutes and 42 seconds with a single vega a dual vega was 1339 so again it was faster but by only three or four seconds again not worth it there's one certain video though that I have tested with the entire time I've used FCPX and I actually named the video test. It's not on YouTube, it's not anywhere like that. It's just a video that I have random effects, transitions, stuff like that. It's about a six and a half, seven minute video. And it is, like I said, it's actually called test. So when I first ran it with a single Vega under 10.14.2 and, and FCPX 10.4, .5 again, I believe. It ran in 3 minutes and 41 seconds. A dual Vega done in 3 minutes 5 seconds. So a 35, 40 second difference on that one. Now then, when you jump up to 10.15.0, it dropped to 3 minutes 33 seconds. Again, that's a single Vega. With a dual Vega, it done the test in 334.30, which is one second slower than the single Vega. Again, I know it's crazy, but th this is that's why I'm saying, is it worth running duels anymore? 
Now then, when you jump up with a single bag under test video, under 10.15.1, it's a 333.28. With duals, 329.79, so it's two or three seconds, again, faster. I'm gonna put up this uh, spreadsheet that I have between the singles and duals, but like I said, you know, right now, don't don't fool with running dual video cards. Hopefully they'll fix this and you know see what's going on. Again though, but under the other releases, you know, it helped, but not enough to justify dual video cards. Again, that's my you know I've looked at the numbers, I've done them and done them. I cannot justify running dual video cards as of right now. However, though. As always, guys, I am open to any suggestions. So if you have something you want tested, you want me to run the file for you, however you want to do it, you know, drop it in the comments. Let me know. I'll be glad to respond. I respond as quick as I possibly can. I appreciate you guys for watching. Continue to support me and everything you do for me, guys. And always, thanks for watching. Have a good one.